Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I made this beautiful jade and gold resin tray. Here are the supplies I used. Mid-City from Mr. Nola's Glitter, Paradise from my collections, Ranger Gold Mica Powder, Gold Flakes from Amazon, and Diamond Emerald Green Mica Powder. Here's my handle mold. Let's get started. I poured about 80 milliliters of resin into each of these four cups. Now I'm going to pour in my glitters and mica powders and gold leaf until I'm satisfied. A good rule of thumb is don't use more than 10% additive to your um, epoxy mixture, otherwise you might not get a good cure. So you saw there I mixed the Mid City from Mr. Nola's and Paradise from Recollections into that cup. Now we have the Diamond Emerald Green Mica Powder from Black Diamond Pigments. It's so pretty. It says it's emerald. It's more jade to me. And this is a gold pigment powder from Ranger. It's like a mica powder. And this is our gold flake that I got off of Amazon. Stir everything in. I love these glass stir sticks. I can just wipe them off with a paper towel and reuse. Here's my gold mica powder. I'm usually pretty aggressive when I mix in the leaf if I haven't kind of shredded it before I put it in there. This breaks up all those particles and gets it good and mixed in. You don't want thick chunks. and my green. Let's get pouring.
So I let that cure overnight. I demolded my handles. I wanted clear for this project. And to attach them, you just use a little bit of hot glue. This keeps them in place. And we're gonna kind of lock them in place with more resin. So once we pour the next um, layer of resin, it will cure and the handles will be basically sealed in. So the tops of the handles will need just a tiny little, almost like a little bubble coat. They're not completely flat when you take them out of the mold. So just add a little to the top and uh, make sure it's spread out. so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I've got lots of cool things coming up.